everyone. Uh, we just did a review of our May and June empties for food and dog treats, but I would like to do bath and body set now. Uh, we obviously we've used more products than these, but these were all new and I thought they were worth sharing. First up we have J.R. Watkins hand soap. This is the foaming hand soap and this is grapefruit. We loved this. It smells just like grapefruit. It's um, it's a really good hand soap. I wash my hands about 20 times a day and my hands never got dried out. So for anyone who's like me and you're washing your hands all the time, I cannot recommend this enough. They are cruelty free. Their parent company is J.R. Watkins, so they're completely cruelty free. They run about $3.99 retail. I think we picked these up, the set of two, at Fresh Market. Um, two for five or so. So anyway, get them on sale if you can. Highly recommend the grapefruit. Great soap, great smell. We'll be buying again. Okay, uh, I'll go ahead and do the other hand soap that I picked up in that shopping trip. This is the lavender scent. It's the same soap, different scent. I love lavender. It's probably my favorite essential oil smell. However, I did not like the scent of lavender that they used in this soap. It actually smells like if Pine Sol added lavender to their product. It was chemical lavender, not floral lavender, and they are different. Um, I trust the product, I trust the company, I just didn't enjoy the scent of this. And again, the soap is great. I highly recommend the soap. I did not like the lavender, so I won't be buying the lavender again. I will buy any other soap from them though. Okay, next up we have Briogeo Rosarco Milk Leave-In Conditioning Spray. I actually got this in a birch box probably a year ago. I've used it on and off and I like this. I have long, thick, curly hair, and it works well for my curls. It doesn't make my curls heavy or sticky, and it's not a crunchy product. It smells really good. Um, it doesn't work that great for split ends, but if you're okay using something different for split ends, would I buy this? Uh, only if it was about half off, <laughs> because the full bottle is like $30, and I just don't spend that kind of money on hair products. However, I can recommend it. It was a good product. They are cruelty free, so I do like that. I love everything I've tried from Briogeo. I just don't know that I can spend that much money on a hair product. Okay, um, this is the only men's item in my pile because um, women use more products than men. Hey, men. Uh, this is the Method Men Sea and Surf Body Wash. I ordered this from Grove. Uh, we have an account there. You can also pick it up at Target. It smells very good. It, it smells just like it sounds. Sea and Surf. Um, Andrew liked the consistency, the lather. Uh, it cleans well. It smells great. I th think you can smell it about halfway through the day. Um, it's not heavy and it doesn't clog your pores, so that's good. I think it runs $5.99 retail and it lasts at about a month and a half, maybe. So it's a good product. They are cruelty free. They're a B Corp. Um, so we definitely support Method and I can't recommend them enough. Okay, next. Uh, migraine relief from Target. This actually still has some in it. I just thought it was worth sharing. I picked these up at Target for $1.99. Yes, $1.99 for the 100 count. That is one third to one quarter the price of Excedrin. I could not believe how much cheaper the Target brand was. It was worth it to me to pick it up for $2 and try it. I can tell you that they do work. Uh, Excedrin works a little bit faster. So if that's important to you, keep that in mind. There are alternatives on the market, AKA Target Migraine Relief. Um, for me, it worked in about 45 minutes, but I took Advil in the meantime, and that kicked in faster. Again, you can pick these up for about a quarter of the price of Excedrin, so I do recommend them um, if you get migraines that aren't clinical. So, Okay, last up we have Nubian Heritage Coconut and Papaya Bar Soap. 
polishing and renewing. This smells like coconut and papaya. Uh, it smells very good, very tropical, kind of fruity. Um, the bar actually has little seeds in it, so it exfoliates your skin. This is my third bar, and I picked them up at Food Lion um, for about a dollar each. Food Lion was doing closeouts, but they run $4.99, I think, regular. Uh, I do recommend these. They don't clog your pores. Um, they don't harm your skin in any way. They're not drying. They are completely cruelty-free, and if you're looking for a bar soap, I highly recommend them. Thank you.